Yes, that's it. This is a kidnapping. Ah! Mystic Maya! Mystic Maya! How much? How much do you want? Very good, Mr. Attorney. I'm glad you have such a good grasp of the situation. Hurry up and set your condition, and then return my money is not my secret. What? What I want is a certain verdict. I would like a complete acquittal. A complete acquittal? What in the world have you What in the world have you done have you that that that? This is a bad time to be screwing up for it. I am not the person you would be representing. What? Currently at the Gatewater Hotel, are you not? And I know that a murder has just taken place there. One of the others killed the suspect is Madden Carter. You are, as expected, quite on top of things, Mr. Attorney. Now then, what I want is very simple. I want you to obtain a complete appointment for Madden Carter. Madden Carter? But why? He did not kill anyone, I can attest to that. However, However, however what? However, someone is farming him for the murder, framing him for the murder, and there is smart someone who is setting up to take the fall. I agree with you with the point. I'll be you. Can I believe you'll keep it from the point? You are, of course, at the liberty to believe me or not. However, if there is one thing you can't take, you can't take back. Right now, your very precious item is with me in my possession. Help! Nick! Maya! You have two days. Of course, tonight you will be in question with the police, but the trial is in two days. At that trial, you will win a not guilty verdict. Remember, you only have one chance. One chance, Mr. Wright. One? You expect me to get a not guilty verdict? A not guilty in one trial day? Yes, exactly. I don't believe I was wrong in choosing you, so don't be so don't let me down. Ugh. Oh, yes, that's correct. Now that I- now that I am playing the role of a kidnapper, I can- I can't pass up this chance to say... And don't even think about calling the cops. Hmm, not great, but you get the idea. Damn it! Who- Who the hell are you? Alright, I'll tell you that much. My name is... The Killer. Mr. Dick, where's Mystic Maya? She's been kidnapped. No, it's all my fault. If only I had gone to Mystic Maya. It's not your fault, Pearls. But it is, it is, Mystic Maya. Mr. Wright, I think we, I think we should tell the police what's going on. No, we can't do that. If we do, who knows what'll happen to Maya? Mr. Dick, what about the detective we saw earlier? Come shoot. Yeah, that's it. Wait here, I'll be right back. Alright, I'll take care of Paul while you're away. What? What? <laughs> that was a good point. Shh, not so loud. The ransom is a complete quarter for Pat and Garden. Wait, the deal is complete, complete in exchange for Maya, you mean? Then this week, Pat and Garden is obviously the killer, pal. No doubt about it. But the guy said that Pat and Garden is innocent. You really believe what a kidnapper tells you, pal? Well, considering the terms, we kind of... <laughs> we got a point if Madden Garden is really innocent, but why... Uh, what the hell is with this lag? And on top of everything else, there's all this evidence we can keep finding. Huh? The guy with the eagle says... The, the guy with the eagle eyes are really laughing up like he just caught a huge fish. Um... But it's strange, there's so much evidence that it feels like something's wrong. Too much evidence? Is that possible? Actually, did you can never say something about the guard being set up? Anyway, looks like you won't be leaving here tonight, pal. Just sit tight and cooperate with the investigation. Tomorrow you can start yours. <sighs> Alright. Is there another way? We've also gotta be careful about pushing the kidnapper the wrong way. You're right. I'm still in the hotel. W what happened to me? Nick? Pearly? 
Come on, you guys. This isn't funny anymore. What was that? I see you have awoken. Ah! Who are you? Me? I am known as the killer. The killer? You mean like an assassin? I'm too young to die. Don't worry. You are not my target. For now, anyway. Uh, Nick, Nick, where are you? Help me. Yes, that's right. Only one person can save you now, and that is Mr. Phoenix Wright. Huh? What, Nick? Nick's going to save me? Calm down and be a good girl. Think of it as, as a business transaction. A, a business transaction? I am going to contact him now. I hope you'll cooperate and play your assigned role, Rel. <laughs> What's going to happen to me? Nick, pearls, this. Such as... Good morning! Ah, morning, Pearl. Mr. Nick, Mr. Nick, come on! Let's hurry and go to see Mr. Ingarnet! We have to wait a bit, Pearls. Those ending hours don't start until 9 a.m., so... Oh, I see. Ah, uh, Mystic Maya, if only... If only I went with you that time. Poor Pearl. She's been like this since last night. We've managed to get home somehow, yesterday evening. Thanks to Detective Gumshoe gently holding her by the hand and leading her here. Aww. But it looks like I don't think Pearl got any sleep last night. I wouldn't either, I mean... <laughs> Just... Yeah. Yeah, Phoenix is right. We're gonna save Maya. There's no happy music playing. Well, it would be terrible if happy music was playing here, actually. Um, I have a thought. Huh? You're going to represent Mr. Angarde, aren't you? Yeah, I don't really seem to have a choice. Um, but what if... What if he... What if he really is the murderer? What would you do then, Mr. Nick? Would you fight to get a not guilty verdict for a murder to save Mystic Maya? Pearls. Let's talk about Mr. Angarde first, okay? Think we can think all the bad things we want, but it doesn't change the thing. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry, I can't stop thinking about it. Pearl, you're really worried about Maya, aren't you? I, I don't have anyone else left in this world. What do you mean? My family's all gone. Your family? My father? He left mother. He left my mother in the village and went away. I'm sorry. And my mother... She did that thing, all for me. Mystic Maya, she's like a sister to me. She's all I have left in this world. <sighs> Three minutes early, blah. We couldn't wait for visiting hours to start, so Pearls and I came down here early. To visit one nickel samurai charged with the murder of the Jammin' Ninja. Her. Good morning. How are you today? I know the situation might be a little tough for you. Um, we're... Oh, sorry, dude. I already signed up. I excuse me? I already have a life insurance. I already have life insurance. I signed up a long time ago because my job is, you know... Oh, oh, no, 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 we're not insurance salespeople. Really? Dude, I don't really need that any of that right now, either. Huh? For a fire extinguishers. I mean, this building isn't my house, so... No, 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 we're not here to sell you fire extinguishers, either. I'm a lawyer. My name is Phoenix Wright. A lawyer? Hold on a sec. I'm gonna ask my manager, okay? Is that even allowed? What the heck? Yeah, Nickel Samurai sure is a strange person, isn't he? I think strange is a strange. Sorry about that. You're just in time. Huh? You're a lawyer dude, right? My manager's looking for a good one right now, so how about it? But Mr. Nick, this is our chance. Let's make him let me take his case. I have to. Sorry to 
through, but I would like to ask you a few personal questions. Um, that's okay, but dude, my autobiography's coming out soon, so... If I say stuff without the publisher's approval, then I'm gonna be in real hot water. Hold on a sec. I'm gonna ask my publisher, okay? What? Is... Why is that thing allowed in prison? What the heck? Mr. Ngarve is so lucky he has so many people he can talk to. Um, I don't know if he actually has anyone he can really talk to. Sorry about that. Like I thought, the publisher said it'd be real bad if I said anything, dude. Does he have a mind of his own? Mr. Ngarve, I would like to ask you about the murder. Oh, are you covering this for a tablet and side job, dude? Um, um, well, if you want my statement on this, you should pass through my staff. No, 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 I'm not asking on behalf of a tabloid. Hold on a sec. I'm gonna ask the pre president of the studio. I thought he was about to say the president of the United States. I was gonna be like, what? <laughs> Does he even have a brain? Sorry about that. The studio president said, even Neo Mount Fuji itself knows that I'm not. Um, Mr. Nick, what's Neo Mount Fuji? It's a mountain on the city of Neo Utopia. The Steel Samurai protects it. The, steel, the city of the Steel Samurai protects it. We basically just got no information out of him. I just realized that. What's that? It's a ticket for the press conference. You were going to get one after winning the Grand Prix, right? Huh? Me? Yeah, while well, you were in costume, no less. Um, I've never heard anything about, like... I only heard about the stage show. I always leave that kind of stuff to my manager. You no, know, that's odd. Um, this guy. Man, eh, it's too bad he's dead. You killed him. That's the most logical. That's the most lo logical conclusion, guys. Don't you agree, dude? What are you talking about? You're making a huge mistake. If that's such a mistake, then why did they issue an arrest warrant for you? Hold on a sec, I'm gonna ask- I'm gonna ask the guy in charge of this place. WHAT?! He allows this?! Oh, what the hell?! So I should know a lot of people, don't they? I wonder if that phone is even really good reception in here. Um, I guess you're right about the war after all. Ladies and gentlemen, I believe we might be making some progress here. This guy? I've seen him somewhere before. Is he a member of my fan club? Ooh. Howard. Oh yeah, he's the guy on that kids exercise program. I gave him an autograph just the other day. He doesn't see Mr. Powers in the yard. No one likes powers. That's just something you have to draw out of the conclusion that is that no one likes him. Oh, the badge, derp. Mr. Incarnate, this is an attorney's badge. Dude, I'm sorry, but I don't have the free time to be looking at things like that. Huh? I'm much too busy with the Nickel Samurai stuff right now. I don't have time to take a lawyer's correspondence course. Why does he believe that I'm a salesman? Insurance and extinguishers without this? Okay, that didn't work. Um... So what now? He wouldn't talk to us. not talking to us. What the heck am I supposed to be doing? Um, Presentation of the random thing? Looks like a member of your fan- You know, I wouldn't- I really wouldn't be surprised. Let me ask the fan club president, okay? Um, dude, you know what? We're gonna ask. Club. A lot of sec, blah blah blah. I'm not, we're not making any progress here. This is ridiculous. Like, what the actual hell? I presented for almost everything. The only thing I haven't written is. <laughs> I don't remember. He's not talking. It's a picture of you, you dummy. Mr. Nick, what are you going to do with that? I don't know yet, but I figured I could at least show it to you. Is that a transceiver? Hey, it looks like a real nice one, too. 
I got it as a present from someone. Hmm? Interesting. I've also been instructed to take your case. Why didn't I do this first? Is that what you heard from the transceiver? Yeah. Dude, that's terrible. Don't want some disembodied voice boss you around. This coming from the man with the cell phone on his wrist. Well, dude, I think it's about time for me to get going. Please wait! I really need to take your case! There's always other people who need a lawyer, right? Want me to introduce you to a few? No, 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 I will come in the game and I will kill you myself if you don't let me take your case. Oh, wait. Man, oh man, lawyers these days. Now you do two case to pulling clients, too? If you don't take me as your client, then the killer's going to- Wait, what did you just say? The killer? The killer? What's he doing? He looks like he's mulling something over. Alright, dude, I accept your terms. Huh? I'll let you re re represent me in court. We did it! We did it, Mr. Dick! Uh, yeah. I don't feel any better for it. And he doesn't look too happy either. Go ahead, ask me anything. I'll help out as much as I can. Well, we're finally actually going to be talking to this guy in the next episode. I will see you guys then.